uh, welcome good morning so here uh, today let us see the important uh, constructional procedure of a circle in the isometric view by rhombus method so so here you can see draw an isometric view of a circle of its uh, uh, top view and a uh, front view so when a circle uh, or a cylinder is placed uh, uh, horizontally and uh, vertically and uh, how means uh, just i will uh, show you with a uh, small example so let us take uh, this is the uh, uh, circle so this is a cylinder then uh, if you see from the top of this one uh, then it is a circle and uh, when you see from the front and what you can look at this particular point uh, is how you look it at the uh, front view and how you will look from the top view so this uh, what i am going to uh, show you in this particular video so here uh, i will go with the different uh, principles that is the uh, first enclose uh, it in a square uh, it is isometric uh, is a rhombus uh, with the d and l uh, axis for the top view and then use h and l axis uh, that is the isometric axis for the isometric uh, when it is in the front view so already in the previous slides uh, introduction we have discussed about uh, the d and l axis and h and l axis right so for the construction use the rhombus method uh, show here so here uh, uh, if you want to draw a circle of uh, how much diameter first draw a circle here draw a circle here and uh, after showing the circle you draw a uh, lines which is parallel through uh, passing through the end of the that is uh, circumference of the circle and form a square or otherwise uh, by a simple technique just you draw divide this into four equal parts that is a horizontal line passing through the center and vertical line passing through the center and from these two lines you draw a perpendicular lines to the horizontal and uh, perpendicular lines to the vertical line such that you will form a square so this square is going to be drawn on the line here so first of all draw a line here and next uh, uh, you can make uh, a line here so this is a square so whatever the square it is there i have formed with the l and d so this is a length of an object and this is a depth of the object for this example i am drawing the circle uh, when it is on the horizontal plane that is on the top view on the horizontal plane or when you are seeing from the top of uh, the cylinder then what how i can look the uh, circle here so after drawing the uh, square here whatever the square which is found here draw on the square you point out all these points which is midpoints of these lines okay first you make the midpoints of this particular lines and name a b c and d so after drawing the midpoints of these lines then put a corner so this is the first initial point and then opposite point okay so after putting this opposite points first one what you have to do is from this point you draw a line to a and from this point draw a line to b so write 1 0 to a and next one this one to b and in the same way now this is an opposite corner so from this opposite corner to d and opposite corner to c so right so these are the two lines so after drawing this one then you have located two pointer of intersections of these particular points so from these two points so this is one point and this is another point so locate these two points also and name these one two three four points okay these two these, these are the four points this is the major points that is going to draw the uh, circle for the isometric view so now name all this one two three four so here from one as a center and a as a radius one as a center and a as a radius you draw an arc from a to b similarly from two as a center with d or c as a radius two as a center d as a radius simply draw another arc between c and d and next you have to complete ad and bc so from three or four as a center because it is both are similar uh, three as a center a as a radius 
okay sorry here four as a center c as a radius you can complete this one and after that three as a center a as a radius or d as a radius you can complete this one so now this is a complete construction of an isometric view of a circle where it you are seeing from the top view and if you want to go for the a circle which is made in the front view so now we will leave the construction procedure how to construct a isometric circle in a front view right <clears throat> look at this next simply draw a line here and once again draw this length and height so if you see this one left hand side picture so this is the length of an object and this is the depth of an object this one is depth so towards left hand side is depth and towards right hand side is length and coming to this point in the front view what is the front view in orthographic projection also if you consider in orthographic projection you will have length of an object and height of an object right so in the same way here also i will take the length and this is the height of an object in the top view in orthographic projection if you see in the top view you will have the length of an object length of an object and breadth of an object or depth of an object so here in the top view this is the length and this is the breadth of an object okay it is also very clear in this manner also so now this is the length of an object and this is the height of an object the same way whatever the square it is here so simply i have represented here okay so what is the procedure we have done here first of all we have put the four different points on these four midpoints on these lines right so i'll make shift of this one So I will make uh, four different points here. So now one, two, this is three, four and uh, to name it A, B, C, D. After that opposite corners, this one and this one. So this is an opposite, this one is an opposite. From these two points, from these two points, from this point, you have to connect D and C. From this point, you have to connect A and B. So if you look this point A and B from this point that is point D and B so that you will get the point of intersection at these particular points and the opposite points okay this one and this one so name it so one this is two this is three and this is four so one two three four are the major points so to draw the circle in the isometric view so now from 1 as a center, A as a radius, just you put an arc that is AB. And with the 2 as a center, uh, C as a radius, you can make an arc. Okay. And with the 3 and 4 as a centers, 3 and 4 as a centers with the radius of 3A or 4B or 4C, 4, 3D, whatever it is, it will be the same. Then you can draw the two arcs. One is from this side, okay, sorry, one is from this side and another from this side, okay. So, this is how uh, to construct the circle for the front view, right, okay. Then. <clears throat> Thank you very much for uh, watching my video. If you are having any doubts, so please uh, uh, put me in a form of comment uh, so that I will uh, reply to clarify your doubts. Thank you very much.